Hey there, ocean lovers. We all know that sharks are some of the most fearsome predators in the sea, but did you know that there's other animals out there that can take on these underwater giants and come out on top? That's right. In this video, we're gonna show you some animals that could defeat sharks. From speedy hunters to venomous creatures, these animals have what it takes to survive in the harsh world of the ocean. So, get ready to be amazed as we explore some of the most deadly and powerful creatures in the sea. From the killer whale that's not really a killer whale, to the eight legs of death, here's 20 animals that can defeat sharks. <sighs> Number 20. False Killer Whale What do you get when you cross a dolphin and an orca? A false killer whale. This might not be the funniest joke, but it perfectly sums up what these incredible creatures are all about. False killer whales are often mistaken for real killer whales, but they're a completely different species with a unique set of abilities. One of their most impressive feats is their ability to take down sharks and even dolphins. That's right, these guys are like the ultimate predators of the ocean, and they won't let anyone stand in their way. You'll be happy to know that despite their name, false killer whales are actually pretty friendly to humans, and they're known to be quite social animals. They're also incredibly intelligent, and they've been known to communicate with each other in complex ways. But back to the question at hand, could a false killer whale defeat a shark? The answer is a resounding yes. This creature is capable of killing even a shark. False killer whales have been observed hunting sharks in the wild, and they're more than capable of taking down even the biggest and strongest of them. In fact, they're one of the very few animals in the ocean that's capable of going toe-to-toe -to -toe with a great white shark and coming out on top. So, the next time you're out in the ocean and you see a false killer whale, remember to give them the respect they deserve. These incredible creatures are truly the kings of the ocean, and they're not to be messed with. Number 19. Giant Octopus Next, we're diving deep into the ocean to see if the giant octopus can take down one of the ocean's greatest predators, the shark. Now, when you think about octopuses, you might picture them as small, slimy creatures with eight legs, but don't let their appearance fool you. These cephalopods are incredibly strong and smart, and they've been known to take down even the largest of prey. In fact, a few years ago, a giant Pacific octopus at the Seattle Aquarium was filmed killing a shark. Yeah, a shark. Although octopuses usually go after prey that's smaller than themselves, they can use their strength to overpower substantial adversaries. And when it comes to strength, the giant octopus is a force to be reckoned with. So, could the giant octopus defeat a shark in a battle? Well, it's certainly possible. The octopus has eight arms, each lined with powerful suction cups that can grip just about anything. Plus, they're incredibly flexible and they can wrap their arms around their prey, suffocating them to death. On the other hand, sharks are fast and agile swimmers with razor-sharp teeth and powerful jaws. It would be a tough fight, but with the giant octopus's strength and intelligence, I would not be surprised if it came out on top. So who do you think would win in a battle between a giant octopus and a shark? Let us know in the comments below. Number 18. Moray Eel Next up, an epic battle between two underwater giants, the Moray Eel and the Shark. It's not often that we see these two predators go head-to-head, -head, but when they do, things can get pretty wild. In this corner, we have the Moray Eel, known for its long, slender body and powerful jaws. And in the other corner, we got a shark, with its rows of sharp teeth and fearsome reputation. So who will come out on top? Well, in a surprising turn of events, a video emerged of a Moray Eel trying to swallow a shark whole. Yeah, ho, and let's just say things didn't quite go according to plan for the eel. As it turns out, the shark was too big for the eel to swallow whole, and the eel ended up choking on the prey. Not exactly the victorious outcome the eel was hoping for. So, could a moray eel defeat a shark in a fight? Well, it's actually hard to say. While the moray eel certainly has impressive jaws and can use its agility to evade attacks, sharks are formidable opponents with years of evolution on their side. So one thing's for sure, this battle between the moray eel and the shark is one for the ages. Number 17. Crocodile. Crikey, if you thought this battle of beasts couldn't get any wilder, wait until you hear about this one! We're talking about a massive crocodile that was seen chomping down on a baby shark in North Queensland, Australia. 
that's right, this crocodile is so huge it can even take down a shark. Now, I've already guessed what you're thinking. Could a crocodile really defeat a full-grown shark? Well, it's actually not as simple as that. You see, crocodiles are ambush predators, so they prefer to attack their prey by surprise. On the other hand, sharks are fast and agile, which makes them tough opponents. But in this case, the crocodile had the element of surprise on its side. It caught the baby shark off guard and made a quick meal out of it. It just goes to show you, when it comes to the battle of predators, anything goes. It's not every day you get to witness a crocodile in action, especially not one taking down a shark. Number 16. Hippo. Picture this. A shark confidently swimming into a group of hippos, thinking it can take on anything in the water until it realizes it's made a terrible mistake. That's exactly what happened in one instance, as a video captured a shark swimming into a hippo horde and quickly retreating once it realized the danger it was in. Hippos may not seem like the most intimidating creatures in the water, but they're incredibly territorial and fiercely protective of their young. They're known to attack and kill humans, so you can imagine they'd probably also be able to hurt a shark. With their enormous jaws and powerful bodies, hippos can easily overpower sharks in the water. In fact, there's been instances where hippos have been known to attack and kill crocodiles, which are also known to prey on sharks. So to answer the question, could a hippo defeat a shark? The answer is a resounding yes. If a shark is foolish enough to swim into a hippo's territory, it's in for a world of hurt. Sharks may rule the ocean, but when it comes to a showdown with a hippo, they don't stand a chance. Number 15. Hagfish. Welcome to the world of the hagfish, a creature that's often overlooked but is no less impressive in its own way. These slimy creatures are masters of defense, using their slime as a weapon to ward off predators. But did you know they can also take down sharks? That's right, these small and unassuming animals have been caught on camera choking out sharks with their slimy embrace. These little guys aren't just defensive creatures, they're also active hunters. They use their slimy bodies to slip into tight spaces and surprise the prey. And when they do catch their prey, they aren't afraid to chop down. So could a hagfish take on a shark? Well, it seems like they have the means to defend themselves and even go on the offensive. But let's be real, sharks are still top of the ocean hierarchy. Don't mess with them, unless you're a hagfish with some serious slime power. Number 14. Tiger Shark versus Hammerhead Shark. Next up, we have a particularly interesting matchup, a tiger shark versus a hammerhead shark. You might think that the two sharks would be on equal footing, but the tiger shark is a whole different beast. In this incredible video, a group of fishermen captured footage of a massive tiger shark attacking and devouring a hammerhead shark. Talk about a one-sided fight. The tiger shark's one of the deadliest sharks in the ocean, and not just because of their size. They have a set of serrated teeth that can slice through bone like butter, and they are not afraid to use them. But on the other hand, the hammerhead shark is no slouch. They have a unique head shape that allows them to detect prey buried in the sand, and they're fast swimmers. But when it comes to a showdown with a tiger shark, it's clear who the winner is. So could a tiger shark defeat a hammerhead shark? You better believe it, and not just a hammerhead, but most other sharks too. The tiger shark is a fierce predator that can take down almost anything in the ocean, but let's hope they don't decide to come after us humans anytime soon. Number 13. Sea Snake. Here's a showdown between two of the most ferocious sea creatures, the shark and the sea snake. On the one hand, we have the shark, legendary predator known for its powerful jaws and sharp, razor-sharp teeth. On the other hand, we have the sea snake, a venomous serpent that's often preyed upon by sharks. But can a shark actually defeat a sea snake? Well, it turns out sea snakes have a few tricks up their sleeves, and they don't have sleeves, it's just an expression. In this viral video, a shark is seen attempting to bite down on a sea snake, but ultimately fails to do so. Why, you ask? Because sea snakes have incredibly tough and slippery scales that are difficult for predators to penetrate. Plus, some species of sea snakes are venomous. They can deliver a deadly bite to their attackers. So while a shark may be a fearsome predator in the ocean, it's not invincible. In fact, sea snakes are one of the many creatures that have been known to outsmart and outmaneuver sharks. But don't worry, sharks still have plenty of prey to choose from in the ocean. And let's be honest, we wouldn't want to mess with either of these creatures in a one-on-one -on -one battle. In conclusion, while the sea snake might have the upper hand in this particular matchup, it's always best to avoid confrontation with either of these sea creatures. So let's just appreciate their unique abilities from a safe distance, shall we?
Number 12. Sea Lion. It turns out sea lions aren't just cute and cuddly creatures. In fact, they can take down sharks. That's right, folks. In Newport Beach, California, a sea lion was spotted nibbling on a thresher shark like it was, eh, you know, no big deal. I know what you're thinking. How the heck does a sea lion take down a shark? Well, let me tell you, these guys are no joke. They're agile swimmers, and they've got some serious chompers. Get him. Get him. Plus, they're pretty darn smart, which gives them an edge in the ocean. But let's get to the real question here. Could a sea lion take down a great white shark? Well, it's hard to say. Great whites are much larger and more powerful than thresher sharks, so it would definitely be a tougher fight. But sea lions are known to be pretty feisty, and they have some moves that would give them an advantage. So, what's the verdict? Could a sea lion take down a great white shark? I'm not gonna lie, folks, it's a tough call. But one thing is for sure, sea lions are definitely not to be messed with in the ocean. They might look cute and cuddly on land, but when they're in the water, they're fierce predators. Number 11. Ninja Turtle Defeats Tiger Shark. All right, let's talk about one of my favorite animals, the Ninja Turtle. And no, I'm not talking about those cowabunga famous ones that we all know and love. I'm talking about the real Ninja Turtle, the one that took on a tiger shark off the coast of Western Australia. Now, if you're thinking, how could a turtle possibly beat a shark? Well, let me tell you, this turtle's no ordinary turtle. It's a green sea turtle, also known as the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. Okay, maybe not really, but it's still pretty cool. Wait, does it eat pizza? Maybe it is real. So what happened with the turtle and the shark? Well, this brave turtle was just minding its own business when a hungry tiger shark decided to attack. But this turtle wasn't about to be shark food. It used its ninja skills to dodge the shark's attack and even gave it a good bite on the nose. The tiger shark probably thought it had an easy meal, but it didn't count on the ninja turtle's quick reflexes and sharp teeth. In the end, the turtle came out victorious and the shark swam away, probably feeling pretty embarrassed. But could the Ninja Turtle defeat any shark? Well, it's hard to say for sure. Green sea turtles are known to be tough and agile, but there are some sharks that might still give them a run for their money. Either way, it's always impressive to see a smaller animal take on a bigger predator and come out on top. Number 10, the Kraken. Oh boy, you know what's cooler than a shark? A giant squid, of course, but what about a Kraken? Yeah, that's right, the legendary sea monster that's inspired countless stories and myths throughout history. So what would happen if a Megalodon, the biggest shark to ever live, and a Kraken, the giant squid monster, went head to head in a fight to the death? Now picture this, the Megalodon, with its razor sharp teeth and incredible power, attacks the Kraken. But the Kraken's no joke. It's got suction cups on its tentacles that could latch onto the Megalodon with ease. The shark could bite one of the Kraken's tentacles, but the Kraken's grip would still be unbreakable. It would continue to wrap up the Megalodon, dragging it towards its mouth. So, could the Megalodon defeat the Kraken? Well, it's not looking too good for the shark. The Kraken's tentacles are too strong, and its suction cups are too effective. The Megalodon might be massive and powerful, but it would not stand a chance against the Kraken's superior strength and agility. All in all, it's safe to say that if a Megalodon and a Kraken ever found themselves in a fight, the Kraken would be the victor. Number 9. Blue Whale now, we're talking about the biggest animal in the world, the blue whale. This majestic creature is a true giant of the ocean, and it has very few natural predators. But could it defeat a shark? Let's find out. The blue whale's biggest asset is its size, which makes it difficult for sharks to even consider attacking them. Blue whales can grow up to 100 feet long, and they weigh around 200 tons. That's like 16 elephants stacked on top of each other. Even the largest sharks, like the Great White, wouldn't stand a chance against this behemoth. However, sharks are known to be great hunters, and they have evolved to take down large prey. But the blue whale's size and tough skin make it an extremely difficult target to take on. In fact, blue whales have been known to accidentally collide with sharks, killing them instantly. So, could a blue whale defeat a shark? Absolutely! While sharks might be great hunters, the blue whale's size and strength make it almost invincible. The blue whale is a true titan of the ocean, and it's clear that even sharks know not to mess with them. Number 8. Box Jellyfish 
Introducing the world's most venomous sea creature, the box jellyfish. Now, if you thought sharks were scary, wait until you hear about these guys. These jellyfish are not to be trifled with, my friends. They have tentacles that are 10 feet long. They're lined with thousands of stinging cells that can release toxins that attack the heart and the nervous system of their prey. In fact, their venom is so deadly, it can cause heart failure in a human within minutes. So if you're thinking about planning a trip to the ocean, you might want to think twice before tangling with a jellyfish. But on the plus side, they're beautiful to look at, with their delicate translucent bodies and hypnotic pulsations. Now let's get to the million dollar question. Could a box jellyfish defeat a shark? Well, these jellyfish aren't really known for their fighting prowess, but if a shark were to come into contact with one of those tentacles, it would be in for a world of hurt. The venom could incapacitate the shark, giving the jellyfish the upper hand. But let's be real here. If a shark really wanted to take on a box jellyfish, it could probably do so with relative ease. After all, sharks are some of the most efficient predators in the ocean. So while the box jellyfish is certainly a force to be reckoned with, I wouldn't put my money on it in a fight against a shark. Number 7. Ciliates Well, well, well. Looks like sharks have some competition. The tiny but mighty ciliates are making headlines with their deadly brain-eating abilities. I, I, I got tripped up too, but that's right, brain-eating. Just when you thought it was safe to go back in the water. According to National Geographic, these little guys have been identified as the culprits behind a disease that's been killing sharks and rays in the San Francisco Bay Area. But how do they do it? It turns out the ciliates are able to latch onto the brain and nervous system of their prey, ultimately causing fatal damage. I'm pretty sure that just like me, the idea of something eating my brains will give you the heebie-jeebies. But could ciliates take down a shark? It's tough to say. While they might be small and deadly, sharks are some of the most formidable predators in the ocean. One thing's for sure though, these little guys definitely shouldn't be underestimated. If you're going to the beach soon, you might want to keep an eye out for more than just sharks. Who knows what other tiny but deadly creatures are lurking in the depths. Number 6. Lamprey I know what you're thinking. Lampreys? What the hell are those? Well, my friend, lampreys are parasitic fish that attach themselves to other fish. Sharks included. And let me tell you, it's not a pretty sight. One scientist even observed a lamprey attached to a blue shark and wondered, how far can a blue shark carry a lamprey? And don't lampreys have a tough time hanging onto a shark covered in placoid scales? It seems like the lamprey has some skills when it comes to attaching itself to sharks. So, could a lamprey actually defeat a shark in a fight? Well, I hate to break it to you, but probably not. While lampreys have a unique way of attaching themselves to sharks, they're not powerful enough to take down a shark on their own. In fact, lampreys are often prey for larger fish and marine mammals, so it's safe to say a shark would have no trouble making a meal out of a lamprey. So if you're gonna place bets on this fight, I would suggest putting your money on the shark. Number 5. Zygo Fizzitor all right, let's talk about the Zygophysitor, the killer sperm whale of the late Miocene era. This massive beast was a macro-raptorial early sperm whale that roamed the Paratethi Sea of the Mediterranean region. They're often referred to as killer sperm whales because of their size and niche, which is similar to that of orcas. Can they take on a shark? Well, based on some pretty gnarly images on Reddit, it seems like they have no problem attacking sharks. In fact, there's a photo of one attacking a shark, and let me tell you, it's not for the faint of heart. But what makes the Zygophysitor so terrifying? For one, they were massive. Estimates suggest they could grow up to 20 feet long, which is almost as long as a school bus. And they had a massive set of teeth, perfect for tearing apart anything unlucky enough to cross their path. So could a shark defeat a Zygophysitor? Honestly, it's another hard call. Sharks are certainly tough creatures, but when you're up against a giant killer sperm whale, things don't look that good. In fact, I would say that the odds are heavily stacked against the shark in this case. All in all, the Zygophysitor was a true terror of the sea, and I'm glad I wasn't swimming around in the Partethi Sea during the late Miocene era. I'll stick to the kiddie pool, thank you very much. Number 4. Orca versus Great White Shark Earlier, we talked about the false killer whale, but what about the authentic, certified, real-deal killer whale? 
Let's find out. These massive dolphins are some of the most skilled hunters in the world. They travel in pods, and they're known for their cooperation and intelligence. Orcas have been known to take on animals much larger than themselves, including great white sharks. Oh, so speaking about them, let's talk about great white sharks. These sharks are one of the most feared animals in the ocean, with a reputation for being ruthless predators. They can grow to be up to 20 feet long, and they have razor-sharp teeth that can tear through almost anything but could they take on an orca? In a battle between these two giants, the orca would very likely come out on top. While the Great White is a formidable opponent, orcas have a few advantages. For one, they're way bigger than Great Whites, and their powerful jaws and teeth can crush through a shark's tough skin and bones. Plus, orcas are incredibly intelligent, and they work together to take down their prey. So there you have it. In a battle between orcas and Great Whites, the orcas would most likely come out victorious. But still, just the same, we can definitely look at both of these creatures and see that they're amazing in their own right. They both deserve our respect. Number 3. Sperm Whale Next up, we have the Sperm Whale. These behemoths are the largest toothed predators on the planet, weighing in at a whopping 45 to 65 tons. They use their massive heads to headbutt their prey, and their teeth are long enough to pierce even the toughest of shark hides. So who would win in this fight? Uh, it's actually not as clear cut as you might think it is. The sperm whale has the size advantage and the ability to use its head as a battering ram, but the shark is faster and more maneuverable. In reality, it's super unlikely that these two creatures would actually ever fight. They occupy different parts of the ocean, and they hunt different prey. Plus, sperm whales are typically really docile. They don't pose a threat to humans, while sharks have a bit of a reputation for being, well, not so friendly. In the end, the question of who would win in a fight between a sperm whale and a shark might remain unanswered. But one thing is for sure, you wouldn't want to be caught in the middle of that fight. Number 2. Dolphins now we're diving into the world of the ocean's most popular creatures, dolphins. Most people grew up thinking of dolphins as friendly, smiling creatures of the sea, while sharks are ferocious predators. But what if I told you that sharks actually fear dolphins? That's right, you heard it here, and, and it's true. So what makes dolphins so intimidating to sharks? Well, for starters, dolphins are incredibly intelligent animals, often displaying problem-solving skills and social behavior that rivals our own. They also have a reputation for being quite aggressive towards sharks. You see, dolphins aren't afraid to defend themselves and their pod against a shark attack. And believe me, you don't want to mess with a pack of angry dolphins. But how exactly does a dolphin defend themselves against a shark? Well, for starters, they have incredibly powerful jaws, and they can deliver a powerful bite if they need to. But what really sets them apart is their speed and agility. Dolphins are one of the fastest swimmers in the ocean, reaching speeds of up to 60 kilometers an hour. In comparison, the average shark can only swim around 35 kilometers an hour. So if a dolphin needs to escape a shark, it's a pretty easy thing for it to outrun it. Of course, it's important to remember that not all sharks are created equal. Some species, like the great white shark, are known for their size and power. And while a dolphin might be able to outswim a great white, it would definitely have a hard time winning in a fight. But for the most part, sharks tend to avoid dolphins when possible, recognizing them as a formidable opponent. Sharks may be the kings of the ocean, but even they have something to fear. And it just goes to show that intelligence and strategy can be just as powerful as raw strength. And who knows, maybe one day we'll see a dolphin take on a shark in the ultimate battle of the sea. Number 1. Mosasaurus Let's finish up with an epic battle between two of the most badass creatures to ever roam the ocean the Mosasaurus and the Megalodon. Now, we all know the Megalodon was a prehistoric shark, and the Mosasaurus was a giant sea lizard, but let's not judge a book by its cover. These two predators were both apex predators in their respective eras, and they were both terrifying in their own right. But let's get straight to the big question. Who would win in a fight? The Mosasaurus was longer and heavier than the Megalodon, but the shark had a massive jaw with razor-sharp teeth. The Mosasaurus had a powerful jaw too, but their teeth weren't as sharp. However, it did have a flexible body that was long and could wrap around the Megalodon and crush it with incredible strength. On the other hand, the Megalodon was faster and more agile than the Mosasaurus, which would allow it to dodge and weave around its opponent's attacks. Plus, its massive teeth would easily slice through the Mosasaurus' thick skin. So, who would win in this epic battle? I think it would be a close call. If the Mosasaurus managed to get a hold of the Megalodon with its powerful jaws, it could potentially crush the shark into submission. But if the Megalodon could dodge the Mosasaurus' attacks and land a few good bites, it could take down the sea lizard. 
Professor. In the end, it's up to you to decide who the true champion of the ocean would be. But let's just hope we never have to witness this battle firsthand. So, what other sea creatures do you think could take on a shark and win? Have you ever seen a shark in real life? Let us know in the comments below. Also, check out our other cool stuff showing up on screen right now. See you next time.